Hello, I'm Thomas Brown with Bosch Rexroth. I'm here at Automate talking about the TS Plus conveyance system. The differentiators on our system are as simple as the pallet itself. Our competitors use just straight steel pallets running on a part. We have wear strips which are well thought out where it saves the pallet. These can be replaced as well as we have pass-throughs that allow us to capture the pallet on the front end or the back end depending on the need for the spacing of the conveyor. We also have spots for RFID to be mounted on the pallet. The conveying line system is designed such that it allows us to work around the conveyor without having to worry about pinch points. I can uh, reach in, we, there's nothing to snag, the pallet stops are self-contained. Uh, the system is considered a power and free system, which means the continuing running conveyor with stops and lifts to do the work as needed, whereas is done. We have a multiple way of transporting on this. Well, here you see a lift to transfer conveyor where it lifts it up, transferred over to the other side, and goes around. Sometimes you need to have pallet orientation where it stays the same, uh, which means to say if the pallet's on the outside, it stays on the outside all the way around. Um, to do that, we can either do a lift and rotate to get the pallet back in its orientation in this kind of system, or if you look over here on this line, we have what's called a KE2 turn, which allows the whole pallet to turn, keeping the pallet in the same orientation always as it goes around the conveyor. In addition here, this shows a longer run of our belt system. These are tooth belts that come sized to the conveyor. You do, uh, keeps your downtime down um, so that you don't have to weld a belt. You just can replace the belt if, you, if a belt breaks. On the far side here, we have what's called an FTS linear motor, which allows us to do a number of things, whether it be precision placement, not having to use the lift position unit to position my part to do work, or just do fast movement or back and forth movement, which means I could use a, a single station to do multiple work for that part that you're working on assembly wise. Just finished showing the two different conveying demos we have here at Automate. If you have any questions, please contact Airline Hydraulics and they'll be able to help you.